You've said that uh, you could have beat uh, Bruce Lee. Oh, I wish I didn't say that shit. <laughs> well, you know what's funny is just mm. randomly, I was watching End of the Dragon the other night. Uh -huh. I had forgotten how small Bruce Lee was. Yeah, see, the thing is, I made a mistake. <laughs> what, what does he weigh, like 160 pounds or no, something? No, 132. 132, there you go. I mistakenly said that. I might be able to beat Bruce Lee. Look. I'll tackle him first. The, the fact is, <laughs> you know, I am one of these people who, like a lot of action people, stars, or, you know, martial arts stars, I benefit by the belief that martial arts heroes can beat a whole slew of people. I benefit. My family gets fed behind that. So I can't hate on that very much. So that illusion of um, a martial artist being able to just beat up everybody. Well, I think you it, said that at one point you beat up five guys at once. Yeah. So, you know, it's not all myth. Well, it's a, di it, well, it's a, different, it's a different thing. It's a yeah. different thing. I hit real fucking hard. You know what I mean? Okay. So, I mean, and most people are not used to that shit. Yeah. And you weigh how much? 225. Yeah, so they, well, they it, have it. it. You know, and I've done it all my life. So, it, it's a different thing. So, but if I had said that amongst fighters, they'd completely understand. There's not one, real, not one real fighter that would dispute what I said. Right. Because they know. 220-pounder versus a 130-pounder. Yeah. Uh, at the time, I said I was 235. But <laughs> if, it's like. 100 plus pounds. Exactly. And then somebody who is not a fighter. So even if, if it's amongst elite fighters, Floyd Mayweather is, and I'll, I'll defend this with anybody, is the most advanced fighter who ever lived. Mm. The, is, it should be no disputing that. No disputing that, but there's no freaking way in the world he's going to beat Mike Tyson. He could run across the street, <laughs> dive off a table, and punch Mike Tyson with all he has, and it's not going to not going to affect him. Yeah, it's just it's it's just physics. It's just not. So when I say, "Oh yeah, it could have been Bruce Lee," I wish I didn't say that because he's my hero too. Yeah, but I said that against people's hero, and they weren't supposed to hear that. <laughs> The fact is, I should be able to say I could beat you know, Thor. <laughs> the way I've, I feel is like, if I have to fight Thor, Thor's got to die. That's my <laughs> attitude. So if Bruce Lee, you know, and anyone else, th from my perspective, they got to die. Right. But, so, I mean, you know, if I were to ask you, can you beat Floyd Mayweather right now? What? Come on. You know Floyd. I mean, you, if you ask Floyd Mayweather if he could beat me, he would say no. <laughs> I mean, he's, he, he knows what a fighter. I mean, Floyd did. I mean, he did a great job with Conor McGregor. That is the heaviest person he ever had to fight. Because Floyd weighs so how he, much? Like, there was, what, what there was real danger there. But Floyd just, he, he outsmarted him. That was, I mean, I'm very fast. I'm, I'm, un, I'm unusually fast for a, a big guy. Yeah, Floyd weighs 150 pounds. Yeah. Yeah, and Connor is like more like 175. Hmm. When you are under 200 pounds, though, that man, five pounds makes a huge difference. But unless you're a fighter, you're not going to understand that. Well, it says Connor McGregor says 154 pounds. Maybe he was heavier during that fight. No, he was definitely he, he, heavier. He was so much bigger than Floyd. I mean, you look at the skeleton. You know what I mean? That, a lot of times, you take the flesh away. Look at the skeleton of the fighters. That really shows you what's really happening. Okay, yeah. But um, yeah, and and it's. You know, so Floyd dismantled them the real smart way, but Floyd was in real danger because he's fighting a much bigger dude. Yeah, getting hit with the wrong punch and boom. Yeah, for, yeah. for real. So it's, it's a different thing. I mean, it's, Floyd's such a master, but it's different when you're, you know, you got right. that much, uh, that so, difference of a weight. So on top of you being able to beat uh, Bruce Lee, you're now I shouldn't saying, have said that shit. You're now I saying you, I could, have said you could also beat Floyd Mayweather. Well, of course. <laughs> this, is, this is the new Come quote. on, come on. I can beat Bruce Lee and Floyd Mayweather. Well, well, you might as well just say it at the same time. But, but what? But Floyd <laughs> wouldn't say he'd beat Conor McGregor in a, in a street fight. Yeah. He wouldn't say that. Yeah, kicking and so forth. Yeah, because then you're saying fighting, you're mean, you mean everything. You know, it's like, come on. You know, that's... I, I, man, like again, Floyd's the best boxer who ever freaking lived. I'm the biggest Floyd Mayweather fan. I I even like in in my choreography and you know never back down three. I'm doing Floyd Mayweather shit in there. You know what I mean? He's influenced me so much. I study that guy. I will watch Floyd Mayweather on slow motion like for an hour. Like 
I, I'm a I'm a fight nerd. That dude is just the most advanced ever. But I mean that whole. And that whole Bruce Lee thing, if there was something I could take back, I would have taken back that statement because <laughs> I just fucked with everybody's hero, including mine, right? <laughs> so I sound like an absolute asshole, even though I'm, I'm, you know, of course it's, it's the truth. If he had to fight anybody that was above 150, it's, you're, you're an actor fighting a real fighter. Like if he had to fight Benny Urquidez, oh my God, Benny Urquidez, fighting is not pretty. It's trading blows. You know, if you're not used to getting hit, guess what's going to happen? Mm. You know, so it's, you know, I, I hate that I said it, but it is the truth. Um, but I'm not, I'm not saying it to make myself look better. Shit. I'm talking about beating a guy 132 pounds. I, that's some bully <laughs> shit. That's not something I'm proud of. Right. I, I thought I was just educating people on, hey, you know, look, use your common sense. No, this this can't happen. Yep. You know. It is what it is. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, I hate that I said it.